I'm a slow one, no I don't take shit, I got no love for the fakeness If you wanna play tough and wanna hate this, I'll show up I don't ever slow up, no I don't take shit, I got no love for the fakeness CBS is the bold and beautiful sports reveal that Lee and Jack's family are known for loving each other and being very happy and harmonious, but ever since Lee discovered that Jack had an affair with Sheila and had a child together, that stepchild is Finn, and the child that Lee has always loved and spoiled because Lee and Jack have no children. They want to adopt a child, so Jack took the time to bring back his, his and Sheila's child and said that this child was an orphan and his parents had abandoned him. Lee believes that Finn is really thrown away and has adopted him for over 30 years. And no one. And one day, Lee found out that everything was extremely angry. Lee didn't expect that the husband she always trusted was cheating and cheating on Sheila's foster grandmother. Despite knowing the cruel truth, but Lee's love for Finn is real. She doesn't want to give Finn back to Jack because Jack's deception caused his and Lee's marriage to end. Lee took Finn away with him. And since then, Jack and Finn have not had a chance to see each other again. Is there a special time or moment for Finn and Jack to have a reunion? Because Jack and Finn haven't seen each other for a long time, since Lee found out about Jack cheating on her, Jack doesn't know how Finn is going to out, how that's changed. But before he can meet his son again, Jack knows the bad news about Finn. He was killed by his own mother, ruthlessly killed. Jack couldn't believe that Sheila could kill Finn. Jack was very sad and desperate when he met Finn after a long time at his funeral. Jack couldn't accept the fact that his son was dead. He deeply hated Sheila. He regretted not being able to make up for her and take care of Finn, but unfortunately, thinking that grief is over, Finn's death would make Jack torment for life. He learned Lee lists risk danger to be able to save Finn's life again. Jack is very happy and extremely grateful, admiring Lee's love for Finn. Even though he's only adopted her son, maybe this time Jack won't let anyone harm Finn again. He will silently protect Finn behind. Although Jack desperately wants to see his own son, he learns that Finn is still alive, and it seems unlikely. Because Finn still blames Finn for lying to him and Lee for such a long time. Finn still had a hard time accepting that Lee is not his biological mother. But Sheila is the one who gave him birth. Finn does not want to have any relationship with Sheila, she's, who's cruel and heartless. And also an enemy of the Steffi family. The wife he loves so much, Finn thinks that it was he who was born mother like Sheila. He would rather not be born. So he was always resented. Jack. However, the truth is still the truth. Moreover, Jack knew that he was at fault. So he tried to care, love, and make up for Finn and Lee during that time. Jack also loves Finn very much. He's also the one who raised and took care of him. So fancy that Finn should forgive Jack. Besides, Jack always wants to go back to the happy days of Lee and Finn like before. Jack did everything he could to get Finn and Lee's forgiveness. Jack hopes that in the following days, he can use the remaining half of his life to make up for the mistakes he has hurt them. Fans think Jack should be forgiven because Finn needs a complete family anyways. Lee also needs to have someone by his side to keep him company in his old age. Lee will give Jack a chance to prove himself to have realized his mistake. Will they have a reunion in the near future? Can Lee and Jack continue their marriage together and live happily ever after with Finn? How would Sheila feel if Lee reunited with Jack and the family of three was as happy as before?